Oh, so I'm doing up another test deploy of the testnet contracts today. Um, basically, what we're looking at is to see if the sponsor system, the referral system, integrates into deposits and compounds properly. Once I can verify right. that condition, we are good to move to Pulse Chain Testnet and get this thing ripping. So yeah, I'm doing I'm doing one final deployment on uh, BNB Testnet where my dev tools are still you know able to be used, and uh, provided that we get all good functionality over that okay. side, like I said, we'll throw the deployment on on uh, Pulse Chain Testnet, and uh, yeah, little update, guys. I've already uh, written most of the contracts for another little feature. Uh, did we talk about the NFTs at all? Um, Have we talked about that yet? No, 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 no. No, those those are coming later on though. We don't we don't need to talk about them yet. But I mean, you can if you want. You absolutely can. Yeah. Well, you know, mainly just that uh, as part of our code base. Um, so what I've tried to do with Goat Token and with the Goat Feeder code base is make it so it, it's directly uh, bendable or uh, as versatile as possible for whatever it is that we try to build out there. So as part of our current code base, I've worked in a set of ERC seven twenty one. So should we decide to um, lead an expansion to the protocol with NFTs, that would be very easily and rapidly integratable. We wouldn't have to spend much time working on it at all. Right. So there is that to uh, is this, is this, to look is this what at you're as talking well. About with the die thing? Um, test deployment looks like it's going ahead. 